Tonight we're having the closing reception of Facing Our Future. This membership showcase invited all members to be a part. It was an open call. Members selected pieces that they felt told something about how they were looking at the future after COVID. We have four chosen artists. They will speak on their process and how they've evolved over the years and why they are members of the Isla Arts Council. So my name is Tova Hassel Reese Abrams. I am an artist, I'm a videographer, a photographer, and an oil painter. I am also a singer. I do a lot of things. During COVID, I did very little. I was depressed. I think a lot of artists were. I concentrated on my photography. My name is Allie, Allie Berman, and I'm an abstract artist for over ah, 60 years. I love painting different things in my various studios, six studios around the world. A lot of my work is multiples and the pieces go together and they have a connection of line or color or shape. I loved showing here. It's so wonderful for the Iceland Arts Council. I'm proud to be part of it. I'm Robert Millenhausen, and I've been a member of the Arts Council for, for several years now. I've been experimenting with mixed media and combining it with painting for the last 12 years, basically. In some cases, I utilize the photograph uh, as part of the piece. This is actually a photograph, and then what I do is I work around the photograph to create the, the illusion of space. And this is a book that I just... Uh, published, actually self-published on Blurb, and it encompasses uh, bike works and also urban perspectives, which is primarily uh, street scenes. Hi friends, my name is Mark Strodel. I am a career artist, and I'm just so pleased to be here at ISIM Arts Council. I am a digital artist. This is what digital art is. It's, uh, you start with a photograph and you mask it. Masking is the art of cutting away everything else but what, whatever you need. And here we see it's like 3D, the, the giraffes coming out of the picture frame, and um, that art is alive, and it's this beautiful thing. I love donating my time to ISIP Arts Council because I've learned that the more you give, the more you get back. And in my short time here, it's like I've developed all these new relationships. It's like I'm no longer an artist working alone. I have other friends and people where we talk and we chat. It's, it's wonderful. It's like I don't have to talk to a wall anymore. And we're all going through the same thing. We're going through COVID together and all this like insanity. And we don't have to do things alone. There are so many membership benefits of being in the Islip Arts Council. You get first calls on any of the events that we have, discounts on things in the gift shop, as well as classes and so forth. We invite you down at any time. Starting in September, we'll be open six days a week. If you check our website, islipparts.org, you'll find out all the information. Come and see us.